Hey guys, how you doing? Steve Lav here. Just figured I'd do my little weekend vlog and talk about a couple of things. And uh, what I want to talk about is, you know, every day is a school day. I truly believe that. And, uh, you know, I'm a working guy. I'm working out in the field every day with my hands and going to different jobs. And I do plumbing, heating, and air conditioning work. That's what I do. And I do a serve. I got service and repair business. That's how I built my business. That's what I enjoy doing, and um, that's what I do. I could make more doing installs, some of these replacements and stuff. You can make a ton of money on it. But you have to do what you enjoy doing in life. And I get a lot of guys that you know ask me a bunch of questions and stuff, and especially the young guys. A lot of the young guys are coming up, and my channel is basically more suited for the young guys and, you know, seeing what goes on out there, you know, in, in, in the world and when you're working. And a lot of these young guys will, will ask me questions and stuff and ask me, um, you know, what, what can they do to find a job? And um, I would say to the young guys that are starting out in the field that are, that are watching my stuff, which I, I appreciate you guys watching my stuff. You you need to you need to be a good worker and um, conscientious and try to do good work and you have to start out at the bottom so whatever it takes to get started uh, you know even if you're just a helper start off as a helper you know make it making minimum wage or whatever it is and then as you go along you you'll pick up experience and you know you'll get you'll get into the the trade you'll get your licenses and get established and. It's America. You could do whatever you want in life. You you guys are young. So just remember, the bottom line is to be a good worker, conscientious, you know, show up on time, and, um, you know, make your boss money. Like I say, every day is a school day. So it's going to be an ongoing learning experience, just like we, every one of us that are out in the field right now. It's an ongoing, every day is a school day. We're, we're learning as we go every day. If you're in the field for 30 years, you know you know how many mistakes you made over 30 years? A lot. But as you make mistakes, you don't make them same mistakes again. You get better and better and better and better. But we're still learning. I learn every day. I go to, you know, something new. You know, a different angle or... Uh, or that this, this might work a little bit better. I'm always willing to change. That's what... You have to be moldable. Especially now with all this high efficiency equipment that's coming out, um, there's so much to learn. There's so many changes coming down the pike. It's going to be an ongoing, uh, crazy, crazy. Um, just have to be willing. The basic idea is to get you know your your basic foundation down. You know how to troubleshoot. How to hopscotch, how to check electrical components, um, low voltage, high voltage. You need to know all that stuff. You need to know how to test in, in hopscotch and, and um, you know, low voltage testing and have a theory of what's going on in the system and, and how to read schematics and stuff. That's that's the main goal. And then how things work, how gas valves work, how, you know, oil burners work. Um, if you're in the plumbing th field, you know, how, how the plumbing's supposed to be set up in the best way. It's, it's all relative. But for the young guys out there, like I said, I'm pushing my videos more towards the young guys. Because a lot of the other guys, older guys that watch me, they're more like me. We just bounce things off each other. And most of those guys, you know, some of those guys are smarter than I am. Uh, and uh, they just watch my videos. They don't post videos. Don't mean I'm better than them. You know, I got a lot of guys that watch me from all over the country, and uh, I respect a lot of these guys. They're, they're, they're really good mechanics, and, um, you know, a lot of good mechanics out there in, in, in watching YouTube videos, and you can learn a lot from a lot of these guys. Some of these guys just do PDF videos. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, we need the PDF videos, you know. There's good information in the PDF videos. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that at all. We all can bring a little bit, some little something to the table, and uh, I think that's what YouTube's all about. We all bring a little something. Uh, everybody works a little bit differently in different areas, a different. Uh, everybody's different. 
Nobody's a superstar. Nobody's a nobody's arrived. Every day is a school day. Remember that. You're gonna learn to the day you die. Once you start learn, stop learning, you're stuck on stupid. And uh, don't want to be a know-it-all. None of us are know-it-alls. We all learn. We all learn. You know, one guy might be more knowledgeable in one area than this guy over here, but you put them all in a room together, you put all the heads together, you know, you get, you're you always better off bouncing things off of one another. I got guys I call on the phone if I'm doing something or I did something. We talk about it. Oh, this is what I ran into today. Oh, this is what I ran into, and he tells me what he ran into. It's like, oh, yeah, 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 you know? I just worked on a, on a uh, little 80 plus furnace that um, guy was having a problem with the heat. It run for a couple of minutes and shut down. So you know, I ch did a bunch of checks on it. I didn't. I never thought about the chimney being blocked. The chimney was block solid. No chimney, big ass. You know, big ass chimney going through the house. I, I didn't think about the chimney being blocked. Um, but that's how it is. You just, like I said, every day's a school day. It, it, it is a. It's a wonderful. It's a wonderful career if, if you enjoy working with your hands. Uh, plumbing, heating, and HVAC is is, is an awesome um, career if you enjoy that type of work. It's been very enjoyable to me, and uh, I feel privileged to be able to work in the field. And, you know, post some videos once in a while. I try my best with the videos. I never said that they were perfect, and I try, I try my best. I kind of bring you what I see, um, bring you along as I go. And uh, that's what I'll continue to do. I'll try to bring decent material. And you guys that like watching my stuff, you know, I get guys that subscribe and unsubscribe all the time, whatever, you know. Not everybody's going to like my type of videos. And uh, it's all cool, you know. That's the way it is. But I'm going to try to do my best and um, bring in quality videos. And uh, I see a lot of, a lot of crazy stuff. Some of the stuff I've seen over my over my career has been some really, really crazy stuff. I wish I had cameras back in the day, but there'll be more stuff to come. There's always more crazy stuff you come across all the time, all the time. And uh, with the camera, it's cool because you can take pictures and little videos here and there. Some some really stuff that, you, you know, it's like you just shake your head at. But, you know, there's guys all over the country um, that do videos, you know. And um, YouTube's a cool place, and and I'm glad to be involved with the HVAC community. You know, um, the HVAC community is a good place, a uh, good place to learn. A lot of good guys involved in it, and um, I'm glad. I I consider myself part of it, and I'm glad to be part of it. And there's a lot of good guys that post videos on YouTube. That I respect all them guys. I really do. And I always said, if they, anybody needs my help, if I can help anybody in any way, just give me a holler. I'm, willing, I'm here to help, help out, and do what I can for for the cause. So, never said I was perfect or a superstar or, you know, the one. <laughs> no, I'm just a regular guy, you know, swinging at the ball, and hopefully I hit it a couple of times. Every day is a school day. Every day is a school day. And uh, that's how it is. You know, nobody's perfect and nobody does everything correct all the time. But anyway, that's the deal. I just wanted to do a little vlog. And, um, you know, I'm starting to get up there with a couple of subscribers. To me, uh, I rather have good, loyal subscribers that leave comments on my stuff. It doesn't matter how many subscribers you have. You're better off with less but good subscribers. I always said that. And I got a pretty good channel. I like my channel. Um, I got some decent subscribers and some good guys that I appreciate. And I uh, appreciate all the comment and back and forth. And I promise to, you know, leave comments and... Um, I return a con I return every comment that's left to me. You know, if some 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 guys coming in there starting a bunch of trouble and being an asshole. That's a little bit different, you know. Uh, we don't want people like that. I rather just get rid of them guys if they're going to be trying to start trouble or looking looking to pick a fight. I don't. We don't need that. 
I want to try to keep my, my channel clean. And uh, PG rated. I'm going to be PG rated. <laughs> I want to do more joking videos too. A lot of the guys like the joking videos. You know, been a couple of people that got their panties in a bunch over the joking videos. And I, I can't please everybody, and I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna try to please everybody. I'm gonna try to please the majority of people, and that's all I can do. You know, I'll do my best. But anyway, that's the deal. I just wanted to do a little vlog, and for the young guys, you know. We just starting out, starting out in the trade. Just make a bunch of phone calls. Find some place where you can fit in, and uh, you know you're gonna climb up. You're gonna climb up this 20, 20 story building. You're gonna start off on the first lung of the ladder, ladder and work your way up. Start off like when I started off as a four year apprentice. You know, I started off making making uh, you know low money for the first year. The second year I got a little bit more. The third year I got a little bit more. I was in the union. So it was pretty much all established and what you were going to make. But it was a four-year run for me. And um, I don't regret the four-year apprenticeship at all. The first year I was, first and second year I was an apprentice, I wasn't ready to be, to, to go out on my own. I wasn't ready. You know? Um, after four years working with the journeyman and the tools, I was saying, you know, I, I, guess, I guess I'm ready. I guess I'm ready. But you know something? It's a long process. Just because you go to trade school uh, and you're out of trade school, it's, you're just starting, you know. You got to get hands on with the with, with with the tools, and it's all about building confidence. It's all about building confidence. But anyway, that's the deal. That's another video for another day. <laughs> all right, guys. Thanks for watching. The weekend's upon us. Um, take your family out to eat. Take your children out to eat and spend time with your children. I, you know, I only got one daughter, but I love her to death, and I spend a lot of time. I try to spend, you know, as much time with her as I can. I usually take them, her and her boyfriend out to eat once, once uh, every weekend we go out to eat somewhere. And it's been an ongoing thing for a long time now. And I, I wouldn't, you know, miss that for the world. Um, very important. Family is very important. That's the most important thing is family. Your children. You know, if you're married, your wife, you know, it's important to take care of your own, your family. All right, guys. Anyway, I'm not going to babble on. I just wanted to do a little quick vlog and uh, uh, hopefully you guys, you know, continue to watch my stuff and leave comments, get involved with my channel. That's what I'm looking for. To, I'm looking to build the channel, uh, you know, people getting involved and leaving comments and whatnot. All right, guys, have a good day and uh, stay out of trouble.